Hi, this is Karthik. I welcome you all for this session. In this session, I'm going to teach you how to write a simple program to find greatest among three numbers using Python shell. Once again, I repeat the topic, how to write a simple program to find greatest among three numbers using Python shell. So in order to achieve the task, you should open the Python shell. How to open the Python shell? Just go to start and look for Python. Where is, yeah. Just click on Python 3.8 or 3.7, whichever version you are having, just click on it. And click on IDLD. So IDLD stands for Integrated Development Learning Environment. Just click on it in order to open it. So now this is a Python shell 3.8.3 shell. So now we are going to write the code. How to write the code? Just go to file, click on new file. So now we want to type our code. So what is the code? We want to write a simple program to find the biggest or largest among three numbers. Okay, so we need three input. Let us say a equal to so input of so enter a value and we need b. So we need three variables. You can use a, b, c or x, y, z. So input of enter b value. Now we need one more variable, let us say the variable C and input of enter C value. So now there are three values A, B and C in which we are going to get the input from the user. We will change the variable instead of A you can change A, X, Y, Z, whichever, whatever you like you can change it. Now we are having three values, now we want to use if. So if, let us say, A is greater than B and A is greater than C, if condition is true, then we are going to print. Let us say A is big and we want to display the A value. Now here you want to use colon in order to close it. After this, L F. So if this condition failed, we want to check B is greater than C. Okay, so if a and B both condition A is greater than B and A is greater than C. If both condition are true, it means that A is big. If any one condition fail, means either B is big or C is big. So now we want to compare L if B is greater than C. Now we want to print. If the condition is true, we want to print B is Or else, if the condition fails, else, so print C is big. So now, after the completing the task, we want to save it. Go to File, Save. So I created a folder called as example. I'm going to save inside the folder. Let us say AX5. So, and then just click on run in order to run it. Now it is asking for A value, let us say 10 and B value 20 and C value 30. So now C value is big. Now we'll run once again, run. We'll give the A value 
and b value and c value so now you can find which one is bigger a is the bigger so i think you guys have enjoyed this video thanks for watching this video